Here's how you can change the size and the resolution of your 3D composition here in Adobe Dimension. And I'm also going to show you how to render it and export it. You can change the size in a couple of ways. So right now we're on the environment right here or at the camera. So you might ask, where do you need to click? Well, all you need to do is just click somewhere here. And check this out, we're on the properties panel and you got here the canvas size. You also can change it by clicking here at the empty space. You also can change it by clicking on these numbers. As you can see, this is the size of the image. You can click on it and it's gonna jump on the properties and you can scale it up. For example, I'm gonna go with 1920 by 1080. And here you can change the pixel, inches, centimeters. And here you got the resolution. For example, I'm gonna go with 200. But now as you can see, you got a huge image here. And if you press and hold the space button, you can move the whole artboard, but it's huge. So what you can do is go up here and you can see the percentage and you can decrease it. For example, 100. Let me try it once more, 150, perfect. Now let's render it. All you need to do is go here to the upper right corner, click on the render button. And on the right side, you can see here, you can rename it and you can change up the quality. I gotta go with high and slow. You can export it in PSD, PNG, PSD 16 or 32 bits. And then you can save it wherever you want. Let's go with PSD, click on render. Let's open up the Photoshop file. And as you can see here, you got a couple of layers. You got the background. You got one render with reduced noise and another render with more noise. And you also got the additional layers unchecked and you got a couple of modes here, material selection mask and object selection mask. And not but least the depth information, which is really hard to see now, but if I increase the contrast, it's gonna be right there. And this is how you increase the size and the render in Adobe Dimension. Thanks for watching.